Hey everybody and welcome back. For those of you who don't know, it's me, Gingerbeard. On today's episode, I got a very special request from quite a few people about who to roast today. Now, I'm not going to be showing you guys any pictures or anything. I'm just going to be going on about it because it truly sickens me. So, I hope you enjoy. So, without further ado, today's topic is homo bashing, for lack of better words. Um, gay bashing, lesbian bashing, what have you. I have seen it in the military, I've seen it in trucking, and it's fucking, it's just disgusting. I mean, these people are so just bored, miserable, and fucking worthless that they decide to try to bring somebody else down with them. In my brutally honest opinion, okay, I'm straight, I have kids, I've been married, etc., etc. Honestly, I could care less if another person is gay or a homo. I mean, if you're a dude and you like dick, hey, more power to you. Not my thing. I mean, just saying, I'm, I'm not going to st stand here and fucking call you a faggot, and you don't belong in the military, and you don't belong in trucking, and blah, blah, blah. So fucking what? Oh my god, man. These fucking unhappy, miserable people go on and on and on when somebody is openly gay. Who cares? Okay? Now, I know a lot of people, okay? I know a lot of men, openly gay men, they're divas, okay? Do I have an issue with them? No, I'm actually really good friends with them. And I have several lesbian friends, okay? These lesbian friends, they're jealous of my beard because they want one. They're like one of the fellas. Like, literally, they're one of the fellas. And it's fucking awesome! I mean, me personally, I, I have lots and lots of friends. I know a lot, a lot of people. And it just aggravates the shit out of me when I come into contact with people that just bash the shit out of openly gay people. I thought that was an okay thing now. Because it doesn't affect anybody else except for them. I mean, just, I mean, does it really affect you? No. And even if it did, I mean, what's it going to do, man? You going to be asleep? I'm pretty fucking sure... While you're sleeping, a gay man or woman is not going to come in and just ravage the shit out of you while you're sleeping. I mean, pretty sure that's how it works anyway, because I'm pretty fucking sure that's what straight people do. Because, I mean, have you ever seen in the news that freaking this diva comes in and just like rapes men while he's sleeping? I've never seen that. It's always been men on women, occasional women raping the shit out of a man, blah, blah, blah. But my brutally honest opinion, you are one of the sick, stupid, uneducated, America fucking ass backwards, hillbilly, redneck son of a bitch if you're going to fucking sit there all day and the only thing that you can fucking come up with to bitch about is fucking gay people. Bitch about something else. Bitch about fucking traffic. Bitch about work. Blah, 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 blah. Do what the rest of us do and used to do. Fucking as soon as 5 o'clock hits or whenever you get done with your shift for the day, open up a bar tab. Don't forget to tip your fucking bartender. Man, why is that so fucking hard? Plenty of other shit to bitch about, but you want to bitch about the one fucking thing that really has nothing to do with anything. What about this fucking Donald Trump and fucking Hillary Clinton shit? That's right, I said it. I'm not even going to bother voting because it's like putting Satan in the fucking White House. So with all that being said, ladies and gentlemen, if any of you feel this way or were offended by anything I had to say, honestly, you can go fuck yourself. Because, yeah, you're what's wrong with today's society. Anyways, if you liked anything I had to say, feel free to hit that good old subscribe button in the fucking balls. Let me know what I can do better in the comment section down below, and I will see you guys in the next video.